I just want to show everyone my newest purchase, which is a Milwaukee router. Um, this catalog number 5616-20, and it's a variable speed fixed base router that I was lucky enough to get for $85. And um, one of the main reasons that I got it for that price is because the base was extensively scratched and gouged. You can still see some of the gouges and scratches here. I actually left this part alone because you don't need to base to look at your workpiece through this area. This is actually the handle, the extended handle. Um, I was more concerned about this area here of the base and what I ended up doing after doing a bit of research on uh, the internet you could actually buy buffing compounds and polishing compounds to and sanding this to remove most of the gouges and scratches and then I moved up to a 2000 grit sandpaper again wet sanding and what ended up happening was that it you know, I almost got the mirror finish of this you can see that it's transparent again unlike this area here I mean the whole base was like this basically you couldn't see a lot but now it's a lot better that's my dog Um, and it's a really nice purchase for $85 and uh, I ended up testing it and it's got a half inch collet um, runs smoothly and I did something rather unconventional for, with the base I smeared lithium grease over it and I wiped it on with um, microfiber cloth and I did that to make the bottom more slippery and also to fill in whatever micro scratches there are left and um, just to protect the surface again from scratches because I my thinking is that if I make it really slick that the chances of it getting scratched again would be lower. Um, you see a little bit of, still a little bit of the uh, scratches here, but I think that's more from the sandpaper than the original gouges. Um, like I said, this is a fixed base unit and it's got a micro dial here. On off button, speed control, you know, it's got a strap, it's got one handle on one side and the extended handle from the base on the other. Overall, very decent unit. I was just testing it this afternoon and um, by all accounts, you know, this was a really good buy. So again, thanks for watching.